just before the video starts, Harry or Roadshaw is in Best of the YouTubers. I unfortunately did not get in, but I'm supporting him. And um, if you could go over and vote for him in Best of the YouTubers, I would appreciate that a lot, and so would he. Um, we could hopefully give away some stuff like some PSN cards or Microsoft points, or things like that if he does manage to win. But um, if you could get through this round, uh, that would be absolutely fantastic. Your votes uh, is all you need, so if you could go into the description, all you got to do is register. It really does not take much. Just put your email and password in. Uh, you can register and then just uh, vote for uh, Harry and then that would be absolutely fantastic. So hopefully you enjoy uh, this video. Hello Fishery Free and welcome to episode 4 of Hybrid Showdown. This is a series in which we um, ask you guys to recommend 3 players who t we build a squad around. And uh, a budget as well, the budget is 200k for this team. And the 3 players are El Arabi, Lukaku and we've got Alan Batch, I believe that's how it's pronounced. Uh, three fantastic players. We have uh, three silver players this time as well, because a lot of you requested to do a silver edition, so uh, that's what we've done. And then uh, you can vote using a Facebook poll in the description. Harry did win last episode. He handed me the sausage. He won by like 28-6, so it's 2-1 to me at the minute still. So um, if you could go and vote after you watch both our videos, that'd be fantastic. So starting off in goal, we have Ponto. He's oh Proto, sorry, not Ponto. Where am I getting Ponto from? Uh, Proto is an absolute beast. He's got 82 diving and 81 reflexes. He reminds me of a lot of uh, Minulay from FIFA 12. Uh, 6 foot 2, 6,500 coins, a 74 rated keeper. Really can't say uh, too much bad things about him. Uh, I don't really like to polish a turd, and I'm not polishing a turd here. He's an absolute beast. Uh, Alan Batch has 83 pays. That's uh, one of the fastest centre backs in the game. 74 defending and 72 heading. He's uh, 6 foot, 5,400 coins, an absolute beast. Up middle centre back we have Kanu. He's got 80 pace, 72 defending, and 78 heading. Don't be put off by his non-rare. Uh, that he is non-rare. He's six foot two. He's got an afro. He's 5,900 coins. He's an absolute beast. And at right centre back we have Antonio Ferreira. Uh, 81 pace, 67 defending, 67 heading. So uh, all three of the centre backs have either um, 80 pace or over. So absolutely solid there. I've played against some gold teams. You'll see I played against an absolutely fantastic team later on. Uh, I'll show some goals from that and you'll see what happens in that game. But I paid uh, 11,500 coins for him. He's six foot three as well. He's absolutely solid. At right midfield we have, uh, I'll just call him Carcelo Gonzalez, I believe it is. Uh, he's got 84 pace, 82 dribbling, 71 shooting, 69 passing. He's got uh, four star weak foot, four star skill moves. He's left footed on the right hand side. 5,100 coins, he's an absolute animal, a uh, fantastic player, I unfortunately didn't score any goals with him, but he's still really good. Then at right centre mid we have uh, Jusilia, I've probably uh, pronounced him wrong and I'll pronounce a few more players wrong uh, throughout this probably, but look at them all round stats, he's an absolute beast. Uh, I was wondered why he goes for about 60,000 coins, but now I've played with him, he's absolutely solid. Uh, his pace is decent at 80. All his other stats are absolutely fantastic. His long shots are amazing, even though it's only says 64 shooting. Uh, I do score one goal with him, you'll see later on. Four star skill moves as well, which is an uh, added bonus. Three star weak foot, he's an absolutely solid player. Now, at left centre mid, we have Oj. Oh, right, I'm going to fail at this. O Ojidia Ofeu. Alright, I gave it a shot, but he's got all round solid stats as well. Uh, very similar to Gisalilo. I've got to stop fucking pronouncing these names. <laughs> but um, all of them all around stats are amazing. 6 foot 1, 12,000 coins. Uh, these two make a solid partnership in midfield. Now, over on left midfield, we have El Ganassi. Uh, perfect link with Lukaku. Uh, he's got 85 pace, 80 foot, 81 dribbling, 4 star skill moves, 3 star weak foot, 11,500 coins. His default for, um, position is a left wing. I brought him already converted to a left midfield. Now centre forward we have Basufa. He's the only goal player who I have in my squad. Uh, he's got 78 pace, 73 shooting, 79 passing, and 86 dribbling. Of course, he's got four star weak foot, five star skill moves. 950 coins is absolutely fantastic for player them skill moves. And uh, talking about the last two, we got El Arabi. 78 pace, 74 shooting, 86 dribbling. His default is just centre forward, but I did pay um, 50,500. Already converted to a striker. Four star weak foot, four star skill moves. And look at that goal scoring record, 5 goals in 3 games for me, you'll see some of them later on, he's an absolutely beast. And then Lukaku as well, 81 pace, 73 shooting, 74 heading, he's an absolute unit, 6 foot 3, 52,000 coins, 5 goals in 3 games, absolutely solid. These two are undefaultable, they're uh, so good together and I really do recommend the squad. 
it cost 187,000 coins so I didn't use up all my budget but um, now you'll hear what Harry thinks about my team and then you'll hear uh, you'll see the goals I've scored with the squad What's up guys, Harry here. I'm now taking a quick look at FIFA's team. First of all, it just looks amazing. Seriously, some outstanding players in there. I would love to use this team. That right wing there, Caceres Gonzalez. He's got four star skills and his left foot on the right hand side. He's an absolute joy to play with. I can vouch for that. Uh, he's using one goal player in his team, which is Busufa. I use Busufa in my team, but in a slightly different way. You have to come check out my video to see what I did with him. Uh, so one goal player in there. I actually think I used a few more goal players in my team. Uh, but his defence looks completely solid. Can he with the centre back role? That that afro uh, obviously means he's absolutely fantastic and that team just looks unbelievable a, a, a fantastic team there fishy well done uh, you should be very proud of your effort you know what give yourself a pat on the back that's a fantastic team thanks for that harry so you can have a look at his team at the end of this video or a link in the description but um, i'm only showing goals from one game because there was quite a few goals but this is the team i came up against if you see there's ronaldo benzema ibrahimovic quite a nice hybrid actually has javi alonso's in there sergio ramos pepe absolutely solid squad and uh, you'll see what happens the Supers run up here doing some skills, that's what I absolutely love about him. And the gameplay is not lagging, so it's absolutely beautiful, hopefully. So, uh, a nice HD, no lag, hopefully it's decent to watch. But we step up here, and I did not realise, but El Arabi has a fantastic free kick. Uh, we set him up on this, and it does hit the post, so that's unfortunate. Um, he does score, but I do not show his goals in this, I just show uh, mine, just so you can see how the team plays. But El Arabi uh, takes 51 minutes to get his first goal. Now, free kick in the 58th minute, he powers it. But he manages to save it. His free kicks are absolutely fantastic. There were only two I had for him. Um, but they were still very close. Lukaku here. Look at that finish. Absolutely beautiful. And his weak foot just floats it into a top bin. An absolute beauty. Absolutely loved that uh, tasty shot there. You know, I'll take a replay. A little chip over. Muscles off his player. And a tasty finish into a corner. Uh, that makes it 2-1. And then uh, Jusseli here uh, chips it up. And a nice volley into a corner. 78th minute, uh, that's I believe a third goal or something like that. Uh, fourth goal that was uh, El Arabi here, corner finish. Uh, very nice player there and a very good nice goal. And you see a very similar goal from him here. So that video is wrapping up. So you can have a look at Harry's squad now. The uh, uh, link is on the screen right now. Click on that and then that will send you to Harry's squad. And then you can vote on whichever team you think is better um, by using the Facebook poll. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and I'll see you all next time. Bye.